the next one because the woes of Dom Kwabinya, member of parliament, apparently, are set to deepen further as. Uh, her colleague MPs on the majority side are stepping up pressure on the Speaker to declare her parliamentary seat vacant. Now, this is due to her absence from the House, which has apparently been interrupted by some as sabotage or interpreted as sabotage, delaying the passage of the E levy. Now, in a fresh interview, the Asin Central Member of Parliament, Kennedy, Japan, wants her seat declared vacant. Komla Kluche has more. The President of the Republic of Ghana, Nanadu Dankwe Kufuado, had extended the leave of absence from office for the Minister of Gender, Children and Social Protection, Sarah Ajoa Safu, from office, which was due August 31, 2021, at least. That was the last official document that the government had spoken with respect to Sarah Ajoa Safu on the 6th of October 2021, Sarah Joseph has been absent from office since that time till now. The last time she was seen in the legislature was in December of 2021, where she appeared ostensibly to partake in the passage of the E levy, which has not happened till date. Even that, the minority has been challenging whether she was the person who appeared in the house for the very first time fast forward most of the mps from the majority side have launched a scathing attack on her saying that she has held the party and the majority caucus to ransom by not making herself available for the majority to have the e-levy passed what we understand is that she wrote to the speaker asking for permission to be absent from the legislature and further went ahead to ask for extension. What we do know is that the speaker has also written to Sarah Ajoa Safo demanding for medical records where she said that she's out of the country because she hasn't been well. The member of parliament for the Asin Central Constituency Kennedy at Japan has been the latest, launching a lot of attacks on her. He went on to say a whole cabinet minister for gender, ch children and social protection now demanding that she should be made a deputy majority leader before she comes to parliament. You don't come to parliament and you're on TikTok dancing and making videos. Well, this latest attack from the Asin Central MP appears to be one of the highest. And if this is anything to go by, it does appear that Sarah Ajoa Safo is in for trouble if she does not satisfy the constitutional requirement of notifying the speaker of her absence from the jurisdiction and from the legislature within 15 days and if she calls for extension there must be proof to it now that the pressure is mounting high from her own stables one wonders whether she will survive this komla kluche tv3 news accra